What's going on guys, Avery here bringing you another Revelations tutorial and this is how to get the Viking hat or helmet on Revelations. So first off what you need to do is make your way over to Derizendrak. Now also take note you do not need to have the wolf hat in order to get this one. Um, it may be because how it's triggered into the map and also guys it just does help you drop a like. But anyway let's get back into the tutorial. So what you want to do is make your way to Derizendrak and basically follow exactly what I do because it's the most efficient way. Go to the ritual area and look up to the top left. To the top left you'll see a clock. Now start shooting the numbers 115 935 on this clock and then you'll hear the clock ding or gong if you don't know how to read roman numerals i will have the symbols down below in the description so you guys can just follow that but anyway make your way over to the staircase basically bring you down by the statues and also the box area you'll see a electrified urn now there's four electrified urns which are in Derizendrak, Kino, Verkt, and also Origins. And it's the same ones from Derizendrak where you had to, you know, do the storm or lightning bow and fill those up with souls. This is the same exact thing except you need to get headshots. Get X amount of headshots in front of it and when the souls stop collecting, move on to the next area. And obviously Derizendrak's one's pretty difficult. This is a low round type of helmet. But what you want to do is just keep training until you get the headshots and move over to Kino, which is right next to the Rising Drac, like I said, it's the most efficient way, and go to the projector room. And in the projector room, there's only two entries, so it's very easy to get these headshots, especially if there's still walkers on low rounds. Once you do so, you'll, see, you'll hear, hear another audio cue, and also you'll see that you can't fill it up anymore. Move on to Verux by taking the jump pad near Kino. Once you get there, you want to make your way up to the kitchen on the second floor, and you will see the same exact urn electrified on the stove, and all you want to do is sit in the corner and start getting headshots. Make sure you don't get trapped, though. And once that is complete, take the jump pad over to Mob of the Dead and make your way to Origins. Now, above the bunker where Wonder Fizz is, or where Wonder Fizz is, and there's a bunker, what you want to do is stand there and get some kills. And this is kind of the toughest area because there are three entryways, so definitely watch your back here. But once you get this complete, all you want to do is simply hear the noise of this viking thing or viking conch or something, horn, and make your way to Kino. When you make your way to Kino, if you're looking at the stage, go directly to the right. You see the viking helmet and this gets you the purple juggernaut along with the viking helmet and it gets you plus one hit against zombies, which is very beneficial in a way for low rounds. So if you want this instead of getting jug, and this is all alternative, Definitely get this. I mean, I would there's many other helmets out there that are way better than this one But if you're trying to collect all of them in one game, this is definitely the way to go now again guys If this did help definitely drop a like check out my other tutorials on my channel. My name is Avery, and I'm out